Thank you for hanging out with me. This is KG48, and today we're going to be trying out a new game called Zelter. I think it's supposed to be like Zombie Shelter? Sounds like a, a shelter for zombies, but I think it's supposed to be our shelter to fight off the undead hordes that are the zombies. The zombie apocalypse is a tough situation to overcome. Even if it takes place in a cute pixelated universe, try to defend your home and save people from the hordes of zombies in this new crafting survival game. This is going to be $19.99 on Steam. It is on sale right it is on sale right now for $17.99 till October 29th. Then it will be $19.99. Uh, thank you to the devs for sending me a key. Let's get started. I'm gonna go with a new shelter. I'm gonna delete my my old game because I don't need it anymore. So here's my guy. So what should my guy's name be? How about Chad? Chadston. Chad Chadston. Sounds good. All right. And do I want to be pasty white or just normal white? Uh, let's go with pasty white. We go with um, ponytail. Bald head. Is that bald? That doesn't look very bald. Okay. Well, whatever. Let's just get started. This is our, um, this is like a tablet. And that's the thing that we go to when we want to see our stats. It's pretty funny. So, yeah, this game's, this game's pixel... You know, this game reminds me, of, reminds me a little bit of Starbound. And I never played Starbound, but I've watched some videos of it, and it kind of reminds me a little bit of that. All right, so here we are in the middle of the night, and this is our home. All right, and... Oh, what do we got here? All right, if you press spacebar, you can pick everything up. We've got some apples, some rocks. That's wonderful. Okay. And this is our, like, area. Oh, oh, hold on. Okay, I think, yeah, if we right-click, we can roll away. And if we left-click, we can shoot the zombies in their stupid faces. There we go. Man, they are tough. Oh, what was that? What is that? Oh, okay, so when you get new items, you unlock rece uh, recipes. And that was a rag. Obtained by dismantling clo uh, cloth items. Okay, fair enough. Now, we do have an axe to cut down trees, but I find that if I run around, I've... I'm going to find a lot of wood on the ground, or at least I did in my test game. So what we're going to do is we're just going to explore the area and pick up wood. That's kind of weird the way that wood's blinking. There you go. And let's come on over here. And we've got like a wall and a chain fence around our entire base. As far as I can tell, those are the only zombies we'll see until nighttime. Uh, your base can be attacked at night. Although in my test game, I did spend one night and I slept through it and no zombies attacked. I don't know what happens if they attack, or if they attack when you're sleeping, but I figured I'd take the chance and it worked out. Uh, that's an apple tree. Um, I wouldn't cut down the apple tree, though, because I think if you leave it there, it's just going to continuously drop apples. Okay. So right now, I'm going to walk around here and just get as much wood as I possibly can without cutting down trees. I will cut down some trees, but I want to cut down the trees by my house. All right. So we're going to come down here now and continue looking for wood. Right over here to the right, across that street, that's the town. That's where you got to go for loot. So, we'll be doing that probably tomorrow. I think today is just going to be all crafting, getting things ready in our base. Uh, we need to make a bed and all that good stuff. And, uh, yeah, and then tomorrow we'll go we'll go over there and check out that town. Um, the looting is a little is a little interesting. Like, when I went to the town in my, first, in my test game, I was like, where's all the loot, man? There's, like, no loot over there. Basically, what you have to do is you have to smash stuff with a hammer, and that's, that's how you get the loot. So, also, the control scheme is very dual stick shooter like um, I'm moving around with WASD and pointing with the mouse so I can go backwards while pointing forwards so that's pretty cool this game would probably work really well with a controller I don't know if you can play it with a controller but it feels like it was made for that so that would be pretty interesting probably work really good with a controller although I'm a mouse and keyboard guy I can't can't be doing no controllers so you can see right there, I just got some apples from the old apple tree. And I think that's good enough for now. Let's go back to base and let's start crafting up. We don't have a huge assortment of things we can craft. But as we continue playing the game, we make new things. It will open up more crafting menus. I don't think there's a map, as far as I can tell. I comes to inventory. Look at this kitten. It's got blood all over him. It looks like the kitten is like a real kitten and it got hung and it's dead. It's freaking morbid, dude. Uh, that's my waist belt. All right. Uh, pants. Okay. And yeah. I don't see where there could be a map uh, character. Yeah, I don't see any map on there. And tablet. The tablet will show you, you know, your thirst, your hunger. You need to sleep, your hit points. I, Chad Chadston. And uh, all kinds of stuff. Recipes, crew. Okay. So let's come over here. We're going to go press spacebar by this thing. Grab some water. 
so we just drank and now we're going to start crafting so let's go ahead and make as many wooden planks as we can i don't know if there's any reason to keep logs so i'm just going to go ahead and make wooden planks you need them for everything as a matter of fact you can just see i made wooden planks and i'm getting i got recipes from it i can now make a bonfire a crafting bench and all kinds of stuff okay it's about 11 30 in the morning and i am just about done crafting up all these things okay beautiful all right so what do we make let's just make the workbench first and foremost and then we're gonna have to place this sucker i don't know where i'm gonna put it i think i know where i'm gonna put it uh number four you can only place it in the green tiles so you gotta like walk over to a place to be able to place it so i'm gonna put it right there and that's going to open up even more things we can craft okay so i think the next thing i want to make i need to make a bed although i haven't opened up the bed yet uh you know the bed crafting recipe so let's go and make a crossbow because crossbows are dope. This thing's going to be my weapon of choice in town. It's, you know, it's quiet. It's deadly. Worked for Daryl Dixon, you know. Can't, can't argue with success. All right, so what I'm going to do here is I'm going to move this into number one. And I'll put the pistol at number two as a backup in case things go horribly, horribly wrong. All right, so did we open... All right, we got some arrows. Oh, that's what we need stick um, branches for. All right, I'll make some arrows later. Uh, let's go ahead and make a drawer. This will be somewhere we could store things. And I don't know what opens up the bed, honestly. It ain't the drawer, I know that. Or, the, you know, it's like a, it's a chest, basically. I'll put that right there. Okay. And there we go. We got the simple bed. All right. Now we're good to go, man. It's only 1 p.m. and we're already ready to go to sleep. Let's do it. That little green icon by my health on the top, right, top left-hand side. I believe that's, my, like, how tired I am. All right, so I'm going to sleep in here. And I guess I can't sleep right there. I'll sleep right there. It seems like a pretty good spot. All right, great. Great, great, great. Let's see what else we can make. Uh, bonfire. I don't think really we really need a bonfire right now. Um, the stone hammer. I'm not going to make a stone hammer because we're going to pick one up on the way to town. You know what? F it. Let's make a stone hammer. They take, they, they take durability loss, so I can always use more. Plus, it might open up more crafting recipes, which it didn't. All right, the other thing we're going to want to make is a furnace. And that is going to allow us to cook down metals into iron ingots. All right, there we go. And we'll put that right over here. That looks pretty good. Last time I put the furnace right by my workbench, and it, it didn't work out that well for me. Um, we can make barricades. I can make a chair. I don't know what the hell you'd want a chair for. Uh, drawer. Okay, so I think we... I don't know what I would need a wooden cup for either. I guess carrying water around, but... I don't really see the need for that right now. Maybe I should make a... Oh, I can't make a sewing station yet because I need whatever that is. And it's not telling me. Is that like cloth? Leather? I don't know. All right. Well, you know what? I'm going to go uh, get a bunch more wood. And then I'm going to make like... I'm going to make like 100 arrows. Like, by the way, they're not arrows. They're bolts. Thank you very much. Bolts go in a crossbow. Arrows go in a bow. So, yeah, let me make about 100 bolts. There are some sticks on the ground, but not quite as many sticks as I was hoping. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and smash this boulder. And I'm going to get stone out of it. You don't get iron out of these, just stone. Right? And then I think I'm just going to chop down a couple trees by my base. I do want to cut down the ones by my base. I'm hoping the idea is I'll be able to farm the land or something or maybe build stuff outside of my base. So it makes sense to clear out around my base first. So let's go ahead and chop down some trees. Am I hitting that? Yeah, I am. I'm hitting it. All right. Now, you do have to press the space bar to pick stuff up, but that's okay. There we go. Now I'm getting some wood. I don't think I... I think all I need is wood to make bolts. That's really nice. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, just wood. So if you click down... If you click up, it'll go like four, five, six, or whatever. But if you want to just make the max, you just click down once, and that will make the max. All right, one more tray. And then I'm, I'm going to go in, organize, and probably go to bed early. Because my guy's super, super tired. The game already told me I should have taken a nap already. So, okay. All right, so we're going to put in here. All right, I'm going to make a lot more arrows, but I will put my other stuff in here that I'm not going to need. I'm not going to need any stone. I'm not going to need the rags, uh, and I'm going to take the ammo, and I'll take some, uh, I'll take some apples, too. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to close the, uh, actually, let's close all the doors. Now, again, I don't know. I, I'm, they said you're supposed to get attacked. 
during the night. All right, this is a little, a little awkward. All right, maybe I should move stuff away from. The can I move stuff? Crap, I don't think I can move stuff. All right, <laughs> uh, I don't think I'm gonna be able to close the door. Uh, I could probably close the door from this side, and then just go around. Yeah, I think that's it. Well, there you go, guys. Pro tip: don't put stuff near the don't put stuff near the door. It's just gonna cause you problems. Can I plant stuff over here? I don't know. What is this? Nothing? Okay. Alright, let's go ahead and close that bad boy. And close that one. Okay. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm just going to make a bunch more arrows and then I'm gonna go to sleep. Alright, you know what? It's getting late. Let's cancel it. Let's cancel those and let's go to sleep. Space and we will sleep for nine hours. And keep my fingers crossed that we don't come back with a horde attacking. Saving now. Save the game, kitty cat. Save the game. All right, let's see what time it is. We're at to wake up. Uh, all right, 6 o'clock. We're good. We are good. I don't even know if you can get woken up during the night. I don't know. Maybe you can. Maybe you can't. Who freaking knows? All right, well, you know what? Let's go ahead and let's go for a day on the town. All right, I've got about 75 bolts. Let's go ahead and reload this bad boy. And let's see what's what, man. We gotta we gotta slay some zombies, you know what I'm saying? There we go. Grab those kids, we gotta make bolts on the run. Alright, here we go. Whoop. Oh, not off to a good start. Really? That's kinda weird. There we go. Okay. Don't worry, they can't hit you. All you gotta do is keep backing up. You don't even have to do the roll thing. They simply can't hit you. Because, like, they'll, they'll get close like they can hit you. But then, right when they're about to hit you, you just kind of back up and you're good to go. There we go. I told you there's a hammer over here. Whoa. Easy there, buddy. Can you stop missing? There we go. Yeah. Check out my roll, bro. I can roll while reloading. I'm a freaking beast. All right. I keep forget we have to press space bar to pick that up. All right, so let's come on over here. There's going to be... Oh, I'm trying to walk over there. There's a thing in my way. Oh, what is this? I haven't been up here before. All right, so any, anytime you want to loot something, you simply bash it with your hammer. So I'm just going to bash this sucker with my hammer. Get a bunch of metal out of it, probably. There should be an M60 or something in here, right? Shouldn't I get an M60, like Rambo? Oh, God! What the freaking hell is that? I've never seen that before. Can he get to me? Whoa. Okay, I can't, I can't hit him. He can't get to me. All right, well... <laughs> so there's that. I guess I'm just going to go this way. Is this, oh, here we go. I can hit this stuff. There we go. We got some trash. Always loot the trash. Recipe for copper, huh? Oh, dude, I just got a freaking metal ingot. Hell yeah, I did. There we go. Get all kinds of stuff now. Get food... Food out, of, food out of the trash, huh? Well, it is the apocalypse. Who am I to say no? Okay, well, let's look at some of the stuff we got. A water-filled wooden cup. Okay, so you could probably fill your cup with water. Um, copper. Roasted meat. I'm almost full already. We got some iron pieces. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Can I eat that meat? Let's see how much hunger we need. Um, yeah, I could eat that, probably. Uh, hunger's 30. Sure. Eat it. Good job. Good job. Now let's take a look. See, we're not even full yet, so we didn't even waste any of it. Beautiful. Whoop. <laughs> Probably not the way I want to do things. Okay, there you go. See, so you just keep doing this. There you go. Alright, we're done to 60 bolts. That's okay, I got wood. We can make more. I could always chop down trees if I need to as well. Alright, what do we got up here? Oh, I do not want to get caught in here. Let's clear these guys out first, then we'll loot. Oh boy. Blah, blah, blah. I kind of feel like I should be not... I feel like I shouldn't be missing those shots. Alright, you know what? Let's aim for center of mass. Stop going for headshots. I don't think it makes any difference. Okay. 
come up. Come. Really? I think I'm. In Wait, why is it not shooting? There we go. That's weird. It was like it wasn't shooting. Oh, easy there, buddy. All right, you're down. All right, down to 50 bolts. I kind of wish I made 100. I'm not going to lie. kind of wish I made 100. All right, let's grab this food. Might have to go back home soon. Oh, my goodness. It seems like it's the angle that's the problem. There we go. Yeah, I got to stop aiming for the head. I can't help it, man. It's ingrained in my brain. You know? You see a zombie... You aim for the head. I started I started my FPS career playing Counter-Strike. Aim for the head. Went into zombie games. Aim for the head. You can open these, by the way. It's pretty cool. Alright, let's go ahead and break some stuff. That's right. I'm breaking shit. Oh my god, look at all that stuff. I can't hold any of it. Okay. Can't hold any of it. Oh, well, you know what? I don't know what's important and what's not, so I'm just going to bring everything back and then we'll come get that stuff again. Hopefully I can make some kind of backpack or something that would, like, you know, allow me to hold more stuff. It's not like my, my base is that far away, though. And to the power of editing, everything's good to go now. All right, let's break some more stuff, man. I'm going to break. I'm going to break stuff. I'm going to break it. Boom. Come on, break, damn it. There you go. <clears throat> I'm going to break these boxes. Most of the furniture in here just breaks into wood. And wood is not exactly exciting right now. So I'm going to break these boxes. Because these are where I get some cool shit. Look at all that stuff. I should probably eat these apples. Get them the hell out of my inventory. There we go. And I don't really think anything in here is that good. This is probably just all wood. I bet you this is all wood. Come on. Smashy, smashy. Okay, yeah, it's just wood. What do I get if I destroy this rubber ducky? Well, I guess it's not a rubber ducky. It's a, a, a plush or something. Okay, got a lot of stuff. And my bag's full again. Oh my god. Dude, it happens quick. I went home and dropped everything off. Now I'm coming back and I'm going to kind of go a little faster because it's already almost 5 o'clock. And I need to get in, you know, relatively soon. But the thing is, I want to get some metal before I go in. And there, I know there's some cars down here to the south. So let's see if we can find... Yeah, they're there. But there's going to be some zombies down here as well. Oh, okay. Hold on. This is where we get most of our metal. At least so far in the game from what I can tell. <clears throat> oh. It done broke. Oh, hold on. Alright. You. You gots to go, bro. Look like a ninja. A dead ninja. Give me that. Okay. Can I... Move this down here now, please. All right. This is definitely going to... Zombies are going to hear this, but... I'm not really worried about it. They come in, I'm going to blast them with my... With my Daryl Dixon zombie killing machine. Also known as a crossbow. Which takes bolts, not arrows. Bolts! Not arrows! <laughs> I'm going to end up calling them arrows, though. I'm getting tired, by the way. Top left-hand side. I need this Z, 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 Z. What the hell else did I get? I don't know what those are. Hold on. Copper pieces. Cool. Alright. Let's get back because I do want to leave myself some time to actually smelt things. Uh, I'd like to make that metal workbench if possible. That'd be cool. So I really kind of drastically underestimated how much I was going to need wood. So when I... Uh, oh. Weapon's done. Okay. Uh, so when I go back into town next time, I need to get the wood. Alright. Whether it's from... You know, a TV stand or or a bookcase or whatever. I just need to get it. All right, let's go ahead and make ourselves a stone axe just to kind of... Uh, right, we're going to need some wood planks. And we're going to need some stone. I should have some stone. Uh, yep, there we go. Uh, bring. I'll just take them all. Let's close this up. I'm probably going to go to sleep. We're going to do a lot of the... We're going to do a lot of crafting tomorrow. I might not even go to the town tomorrow. Night has fallen. Okay, let's go to sleep. I think we might have actually stayed up too late as it is. Now, I've, I've watched other people play this, and when they stay up, zombies come in and attack. So, I'm thinking if you get to sleep on time, you know, like a, like a good boy or girl, uh, then you don't have to worry about the zombies attacking. There we go. No zombie attack. Beautiful. 
Okay, well, let's go ahead and make our stone axe. And then we're going to smelt up some iron. Okay, so in order to smelt up iron, we're going to come over here. We're going to need charc... Oh, look at this. This is more stuff I didn't even know about. What is that? Plastic into... What? What is that? I don't even know what that is. Copper. Okay. Charcoal. We need to make some charcoal. So let's go ahead and do that. We'll make four pieces of charcoal for the time being. And then once that's done, we're going to use the charcoal to smelt the iron. And then we're going to use the iron to make the metal workbench. Now, the metal workbench is new to me. Um, I did a test game, but I never made the metal workbench. So we're going to find out about it together for the first time. And that's always exciting. Okay, and there we go. All right, so let's come over here make sure we have all the metal. That's all food. Uh, bring. Take this as well. What is that? Oh, it's plastic piece. Okay. I don't know what... By the way, guys, if you guys are playing this, I could do with some tips. I don't know what the hell that is. So, yeah. All right, so we're going to come over here and make some metal ingots now. Or iron ingots, I should say. And we're going to make four. Well, we only need three. So let's just make three for now. Let's not make more than we need. And uh, we'll use that to make the metal workstation, hopefully. Okay, and here we are. Metal, works, metal workbench. Okay, we just need four more wooden planks. Oh my god, where's all the wood? Where's all the wood? Alright, let me go get some wood. Okay. And here we go. Metal workbench. Boom! Hell yeah, I don't know where I'm going to put this. Yeah, I don't think you can rotate stuff. If you can rotate it, I don't know how to rotate it. So, um, I don't know where I'm going to put it. Let me take a look here. Whoops. Here we go. Number five. Staying alive with number five. I don't want to put it over there. I think I'm just going to put it right here, I guess. I, I don't know. I guess I could put it right next to this. Eh, screw it. Let's just do it. Okay. Ooh, pistol ammo. A pipe. Is that, like, supposed to be a melee weapon? Uh, it can be crafted. Out of, it doesn't say. It's got to be a melee weapon. Screws. Okay. Screws. What were the screws for? Um, For the barricade. Yep. Uh, let's make some screws. Why not? Sounds good. I, I don't even know about the pistol ammo. I don't, like, do I really care? I don't think so. Let's go ahead and make some screws. I like to make a bar. Whoa. No room in my inventory. Okay. I really wish I knew what I needed to... Uh, is it this? It's not a plastic piece. I really wish I, I knew what I needed to make the sewing station. So that goes up like that. No, that's definitely not the same as this. I don't, I don't know what that is. Don't know what that is. All right, you know what? Before we go any farther, let's make a copper piece. I'm thinking it might open up some some crafting recipes for me. No, really? I don't even see anything that takes copper, though. What am I missing? All right, stone axe, stone hammer, furnace. Sewing, okay, I don't, you know, again, I don't know what that is. Should probably I should probably find out somehow. Uh, <laughs> Rudy have the crossbow, wooden cup, don't care, bonfire. Yeah, maybe like a bonfire. I'm not usually up during the night, so I don't really need the bonfire. All right, whatever. Let's go. Ahead, let's go ahead and make a barricade. Maybe screws will open up some crafting recipes for me. Come on, open me up. Nope, nothing. All right, there's no way I'm gonna have enough wood for this. By the way, not even close. All right, so in order to make the sewing thing, we need cloth. We need to craft cloth. Now, I was looking in the workbench. I, I always assume that when you get a workbench in a game, it takes everything you can make on your character and then adds to it. But apparently, that workbench, I, I don't think you can make cloth in the workbench. Or maybe I just missed it. I don't know. But I can make cloth here. So that's it. It's cloth. It's made out of those cloth. I only have three. Um, I forget how many of these I need. I think I need a couple. So uh, we're going to come up here and kill some more zombies. And then hopefully, nope, not that way. And then hopefully what we'll do is we'll be able to make that sewing machine and see what we can make with it. Um, I'm supposed to destroy, and I quote, cloth looking things. So, oh, th like the couch, right? That's got to give me cloth, right? Might give me straight up cloth. All right, come on, breaky, breaky. Yep, there we go. That's exactly what I needed. Um, I don't know if it's enough, but let's break this garbage. Oh, bandages. Bandages from the garbage. Hell yeah. If I get it from this, I think this is mostly food. Yeah, the cardboard boxes seem to be mostly food. All right, let's see if there's a couch. I think there's a couch up here too. Yep. 
So definitely the couch. You think I could break that rug? Doesn't that rug look like it has a face on it? Like on the side? I'm gonna mash that stupid rug right in its stupid face. No, I guess not. Well, actually, I could use this stuff for wood. So let me gather some wood, too. I'm gonna have to go home soon, but... I am having fun exploring this area. Okay. Oh, boy. We got a ninja guy. He's not, a, he's not a very good ninja. Oh, dude, I think I broke the fence. I got some wood out of it. I wonder... There, I think everything in this game might be destructible. Come on, reload. There we go. Why Does this guy have a box on his head? Why does he have a box on his head? He looks like he belongs in Minecraft. Okay, well, there you go. Got some metal from him. Alright, uh, how much of this stuff do I have? I have four. I hope that's enough. I gotta kind of go back. It's getting... It's not really late, but the thing is, it, time goes by in this game really quick. So maybe that'll be enough cloth. We'll see. I was one piece of cloth short, so I had to go back and get some more. I'm just going to start sleeping right now. Sleep time. Yeah, give me give me a good nine hours. Give me a good, I could use a solid nine. <laughs> give, me, give me nine, will you? How about... Hey, kitty, give me nine. Save the game and sleep. Wake me up at 6 a.m. Tell the zombies to stay the hell away. Oh, crap. That's a little early. That's a little early. Saving. <laughs> I guess if you go to bed too early, you wake up too early. <clears throat> All right, 7 a.m. Looking good. Okay, so let's go ahead and make this freaking thing. Um, yeah, man, you need a lot of cloth. You need four pieces of cloth. All right, so what else am I going to need? I'm going to need four pieces of planks. There we go. Looking good. Now, what this thing's going to be able to make, allow me to make, I'm hoping it'll allow me to make some kind of backpack so I can carry more. I think that'd be dope. Come on, give me a freaking backpack, will you? Okay, and sewing station coming up. Coming right up. I wanted to make the barricade. I don't think we're going to get there today. I don't think we're going to get there today. If you guys want to see more of this, you know, watch the videos, like, comment, all that good stuff. Tell your friends, whatever. And I'd be happy to do more if it does well. Hell yeah. Okay, so let's look right here. All right, number five. Okay, uh... Man, I really wish you could rotate stuff. <clears throat> Maybe it can. You probably can, I just don't know how. Oops. I was trying to rotate just by hitting random buttons. Probably not the best idea. Alright, whatever. Let's just put it right here. There we go. Okay. Uh, we can make more cloth. <laughs> Alright, we can make bandages. That's nice. Oh, there we go. A waste bag. The problem is we're going to need a lot more cloth. Leather cap. Disposable tent. Interesting. Is this just for defense or... Oh, defense and luck. Oh! A little bit of RPG stuff there. Okay. Well, I, I think next time I play, the waste, uh, the waste bag is going to be my number one uh, item. Inventory 12. Yeah. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five. Wait, I already have 12. It... Waste bag. Do I already have a waste bag on? Well, that, that's going to give me another 12. It's going to give me another 12. See down here, there's room for another 12. And this thing is a ghost image, which means that it, that's a spot for a waste bag. I'm going to have a fanny pack. All right, guys. If you end up enjoying the video, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy. Yeah, make my day, punk.